afternoon, jammers. I don't really have much time to record a video. I'm going on a trip soon, so I just need to get a video out. So, sorry. Also, I'm multitasking a lot because my cat demands that I pet him right now. And we all know what happens if I don't pet him. <gasps> okay, so let's check out the update. So we got this wild weekend and obviously you can tell by the front picture that it's about shops. Which, I think this is a little bit weird because why are there just two haunted house themed shops? The beach house and the bounce house I guess makes sense, but why specifically those? I'm not Animal Jam and I can't answer that question, so let's just move on. Goats. Boring beach house. Oh my gosh! Uh, can Animal Jam please release that as like an actual computer I can buy? Look at that sleek design. I'm loving it. But obviously this is just a little promotion. Oh my god, what is my cat doing? A little close for comfort, sir. He's on the desk now. But obviously this is a look at the new theater mode. So if I zoom out like this this theater can you move oh my god so even though i'm zoomed out on my computer if i click this button it'll actually zoom in for me no matter what the zoom in size is on my actual browser little minor change and then there's the fair bundle items coming out into stores and camels are coming so my theory was right and the rest of this is just other random announcements that's the problem with being a senior citizen in animal jam just meaning that i've been playing this game for way too long is that all these updates just become a little bit repetitive but that's okay but let me show you something that i found a little bit more exciting about the fantasy bundle items you can change the colors this leads me to believe that all the other fantasy bundle items will be coming out with color changes as well so that's really useful for things like the bench and the rug oh wait this is a fantasy shop okay that looks very voodoo-ish in my opinion <laughs> So I guess it's not too on a mansion themes. Even still, I'm just not a fan of the font Ew. and overall look of it. I also don't really like the color scheme on the beach house. Like, I don't know. I think I like this one the most. Oh, a jamogram. <gasps> Ooh, a party and Awesome Fire 104 is done. Go ahead and check out Awesome Fire 104 is done for a soiree. Even though by the time I posted this, I'm sure the party's over, but they told me to tell my friends. Okay, so let me just show you what I was talking about in the thumbnail because this is some pretty interesting stuff. Some of you might know about this, but not many because who reads these days? I sure don't. And look at me now. Sorry, that was a pretty rude thing to say. Hopefully I didn't offend any 64-year-old ladies that love to read. Wait, no 64-year-old ladies are subscribed to my channel. Are they? <laughs> Okay, enough of that. So as you can see here, there are these little animals, just like the one in the thumbnail, in each little book. So here's one you haven't seen yet. There's a little warthog here, and we don't have pet warthogs yet. But if you come up here, there's a gecko, and I'm thinking by the time that these books were released, geckos weren't existent yet. So they had this art of the gecko in the books, and they took it to make the pet. But maybe the geckos did exist before the books, I'm not really sure. But still, it shows that these animal designs are what they are using for Animal Jam pets. Which means that in the future, it's very possible that if they ever made a pet warthog, this is what we'd see. And there's lots more to check out. There's this aardvark skipping across the screen. And these things, which are even cuter, look at it, I don't know what it is, but it's just the best thing I've ever seen. Like, if anyone knows what those are, go ahead and comment. Okay, but there's more. This one is definitely one of my favorites. A porcupine! I mean, that's exactly what I'd expect an Animal Jam pet porcupine to look like. There is even a lemming. I strongly recommend you take 10 minutes out of each day to look at pictures of lemmings. It's very therapeutic. That's all of these little animals. I think the aardvark and the porcupine are definitely my favorites and I'd love to see them as Animal Jam pets. I'm on a hunt for the secret item and it better not be a cereal chair. Gross. That's actually pretty cute. I like it. Now on the other hand, this. This is unacceptable. It is the devil's work. No, just kidding. I have a lot of respect for whoever makes these Animal Jam items because they've been coming out with so much lately and they're really cute. But then there was this and I, I don't know. I'm not a fan at all. I don't want that. I am terribly sorry I keep putting that meme in these videos. It's not even really a meme. It's more like a mini 